Hello everyone, today I'm doing a review of the Rodeo Web Notebook. So let's check it out. I'm sure most of you who are using fountain pens have heard of this notebook because it's known for its particularly fountain fr pen friendly paper. So it comes with an elastic strap and then this little sleeves attached to it. So let's take this off. It is a hard cover and it's a standard A5. The dimensions are 5.8 by 8.3 inches or 14 by 21 centimeters. And it's hard cover. It's probably the thickest hard cover I've ever seen. It's really sturdy, it doesn't give much. And then it has overhang here with rounded edges and then about a three millimeter overhang, I'd say, to the paper. And then, um, this hard cover is really thick, but when you touch it, it actually has like a slight give to it, and it feels super smooth. And because it has a give to it, you can see the imprints of the uh, elastic strap at the top and at the bottom right here. So I guess it can't be avoided with the cover that's the soft. And then it has the Rhodia logo embossed on the front, and then it's just plain black in the back. And it has 192 pages and they're ivory colored and this is a blank one it's also available in ruled and dot grid and the 192 pages are 96 sheets black bookmark right there and then it also has a pocket in the back and I noticed this pocket doesn't line up uh, with the edges here like most other notebooks that have a pocket it's a little bit shorter but it actually makes it easier to access, in my opinion. That's a fairly big pocket. And then has a black cover page in the back, and of course also a black cover page in the front. And the paper is 90 gram, as I said, ivory colored paper that's made by Claire Fontaine in France. So it's really high quality paper, super smooth, feels great to write on. So let's check out the writing sample. Here we have, actually up here we have a pencil then a ballpoint pen, a 4 millimeter gel pen, a 7 millimeter gel pen, and then the fountain pen, a palette metropolitan, diamond marine. And there's absolutely no feathering with any of these. It's really great paper. There's a little bit of a dot right here because I closed the notebook too soon after writing in it. So it needs a little bit of a longer drying time with uh, fountain pens. And then in the back, there's a little bit of ghosting. I'm not sure if the camera picks this up even. And there's absolutely no bleed through. So this is really great paper, especially for fountain pens. And what I also noticed about this notebook, it doesn't bother me really, but it has a very distinct smell to it. It's kind of like intense. I can't really describe this as like just paper smell. I don't know. As I said, it's a hardcover leatherette. And this notebook's available, I believe, also in orange, and then this black one right here. So I really like this notebook, my two cents on it. I love the paper quality, it is really great. I also like that it's ivory colored off white, it's not a, a crisp white. I prefer um, paper that's a little bit off white. It lies fairly flat, so when you open it up, just push down a little, and there's no problem with that. It's stitched and bound. And I think the only thing I would change about this notebook, and that's just my personal preference, is that I would line up the paper with the cover, because I personally prefer that. But it's not a deal breaker if it doesn't. I just think, personally, it looks nicer. And uh, yeah, if you love to write with fountain pens and you're looking for an A5 notebook, I'm sure this is the one for you because I think it's probably the best one out there in terms of fountain pen friendliness. So this was my review on the Rodia Web Notebook. If you have any questions, just leave me a comment. For more notebook reviews, subscribe to my channel and thank you so much for watching.